Thanks for staying with us. Moving on, the Dunka Senior High Technical School in the Upper Dencha East Municipality is faced with many challenges, but to worsen it off, the school has been disconnected from water supply by the Ghana Water Company. However, checks with the Dunka District's Water Company director revealed that the d -Sectec was owing the company an amount of 13,000 Ghana cities, hence the disconnection. This came to light when the MP for the Upper Dentra East, Nanamwa Kong visited the school. Dunkwa Senior High Technica, DSEC Tech, is the only secondary technical school in the Upper Dentra East municipality located at Dunkwa Onofin. The school, which currently has about 1,500 students, has several challenges such as inadequate infrastructure. The classrooms are overcrowded, some classes are jointly held, and there is this gaping hole in one of the school's classroom roofing. The headmaster of DSEC Tech, Eric Nana Mensa, briefing the member of parliament for Upper Dentra East, Nana Amwakun, who visited the school, said the school needs infrastructure support. Coupled with its many challenges, the school also has been disconnected by the Ghana Water Company. We have just one borehole, which serves about 1,200 students. And there was a time it broke down, and for almost one month, the school wasn't having water. And just imagine 1,002 students without water. It's a very big challenge and headache to the school. The water is actually passing through here. Uh, but Ghana Water Company say we are owing them. So connecting us is also another big addition. They are saying we owe 13,000, which at the moment we don't have ready. But there was also another issue which has even delayed if payment will be done. Water had not run through their system for a very long time. So how come that bill came about? Uh, we cannot actually ascertain. Checks with the logistics manager at the Dunkwa Onofin office of the Ghana Water Company prove that this sector has some areas to settle. Well, for bills, they've been giving bills. I think his predecessor paid, I think, 2000 That was the last bill that was paid, payment that was made. The children shouldn't suffer because they owe. No. They must get, it's time to learn. It's the very same time they have to use squeeze to go and fetch water. It, it's not proper. A look at the school's ICT center also revealed that these sectors' problems are more than infrastructure and water supply, as there was no internet connection, and most of the computers donated by the MP were missing with some broken down. Our MP donated 40 computers, 20 on different occasions, and that has really helped. As we are talking right now, our ICT center is not connected to the internet. So when we teach students about internet, we teach them in abstracts. So if they even practice at all, it is their personal phones or when they go home. So we'll be very happy if we have those facilities, internet connectivity, more computers, printers, even projectors. The MP, however, promised his continuous support for this text ICT center. Kwesi Ejie Enim, Vasatwa News, Dunkwa Onofin.